And this deep mulch system of wood chips is really working now. Our last day at the Back to Eden Garden. We're leaving today, heading south. Gonna take a last stroll. Oh, should take the chickens. Paul made sure to give us this for all our scraps throughout the uh, stay here. Kids wanted to pick one last apple. Well, we have one for you. Dude. You got one? Wait, no, 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 let him pick his. Here, get it up, get in. Good job, guys. Ew. Somebody shine it for you? Ew. Here, come back in. I think it's gonna rain us out here. Come back, guys. Let's get an umbrella. Let's get the bikes up real quick. Get them out of the rain. I was gonna talk about some things I learned from Paul. Well, this is one. Nature's got a wax on these apples. And you just rub it off. And it looks very well store-bought. There you go, pretty thing. Pretty apple for a pretty girl. Heads up, Lily. You can come back. What happened? I broke it and broke it. I'm not sure on this store if that happened. I want it. Let's cook out here. I don't want to cook out here. I think it's too wet to go around the farm. Talk about some things we've learned. So hopefully that will. The rain may be clear. So let's make breakfast now instead. Hey, we got our eggs, guys. Let's go in and eat. Breakfast was good. The rain has cleared. Don't eat each other. Did you not get enough to eat? If you guys are hungry, just get some apples. This is the last chance you're going to have to get some of these apples. Okay? So, well, let's take the chickens first. One last stroll through the garden to talk about what we've learned. This is one thing, growing vegetables inside the apple trees. Seems to have absolutely no problem. Now he did plant these trees further than recommended. It was recommended 13 feet. He planted them at 15 feet. So that may have something to do with it. There's a little more room in here. I want an apple. Okay, let's get you an apple. Here's some good looking apples. And look, this is another case of thriving veggies inside of I just love this section of the garden. And here you go. Oh, that one just fell right off. Okay, look. Hold this for me just a uh, Here. And this deep mulch system of wood chips is really working. Now, he doesn't lay it on crazy thick. Maybe four inches at max. I mean, look, soil's here. Soil's here already. Okay, so for him to plant in here, all he's gonna do is that. Move the bark out of the way because he likes the direct seed. And then he puts his seed in there. And then covers it up as he goes. So, not an incredibly deep, thick mulch. One reason I imagine is because he has to go get it. He has to take his truck, goes and gets it. It's free, but he loads it himself and brings it back. Initially, when you start a back to Eden garden, you do it in the fall. And you put down eight inches, even over sod. Eight inches over sod will stop the grass and suppress the grass. And then in the spring you plant into that. And then you maintain, I would say from the conversations, two to four inches of mulch. Um, I've been carrying this bucket all this way. <laughs> Good for you. The chickens are going to love you. All right, let's give it to them. You guys are going to miss us, aren't you? Now you seem well fed already. Their crops are already full. Now we're not making much of a dent for you, are we? Let's go wash this out for Paul and then give it back to him and say goodbye. Go for it, buddy. Can you do it by yourself? No. Oh. Try. I'll help you. No, I got I can pump it. Here, I'll pump it. You wash it out. No, Ready? I'm going to pump it. Oh, wow. Watch out, get in. Okay, you wash it. Wash it, wash it. I'm not putting my hand in there. 
Watch out, we're right in front of the camera. Stand to the side. That's it, let's take it back. Mm. We'll take one last drink, Josiah? Sure. He put water throughout the place so the kids will actually drink it. They're not gonna go inside from their play to drink. But they'll do this. You want some, Mr. Brown? I didn't do it. Well, can you get up there? Good morning, Paul. Good morning and goodbye. We're gonna be heading out soon. All right. Where are you, where are you heading that, where, going next? Uh, we're going to Oregon next. Okay. Going south. All right, yeah. Well, thank you. Good morning. <laughs> thank you for everything. You're welcome. It's been great. You've been a good host. Well, thank you so much. Nice to have you. Bless you guys. Have a good, yeah. good safe trip. Yes, thank you. Can we go for the orchard so we can get some apples? Sure. Big boy. That's mom. I present to you the back to eat and honey crisp. Uh, I can't, I just took some medicine. Oh, fun's over. Time to pick up the bus, pack it away, and go. Unplug her. We are all done here. Bye bye, fig. Bye bye, pasture. Bye bye, back to Eden. On to Oregon. After 300 miles, we've arrived to Oregon. <laughs> Gonna add another state to the map soon. It's been a long day. Oh, have you noticed? We can do 300 miles now, easy. It's 
300 is our new 250. But anyway, we like to do a big hard day and then rest. Shoot it out, Papa. Thanks, now buddy. Go? Hey, I'm gonna lift you up and put this in. Okay. Put it right in the middle, okay? Straight okay. down through. Oh, wow. Good, Good job. Bobby, I you can wanna do, do it by yourself? Back. Yeah, I can do it. Okay, that's the spirit. Hey, Papa. That's the Papa. spirit. The American spirit. I can do it by myself. <laughs> Here we go. All right, man. Good job. For tomorrow's video, we hope to go live at the same time we normally publish. 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern. Hope to see you there, given there's no technology difficulties.